I tell them right to their face, I'm going to stab you in the back. I'm going to lie to you. That's what I've been doing. I'm going to continue to do it. I hope that everyone has underestimated my potential for, um, for just massive destruction. Some ability to control them. I can be the puppeteer and they can be the marionettes. <laughs> Should be nominated. Here, here's my thing. I mean, I know I'm on top of the hit list. I mean, I've uh, pretty much pissed everyone off, and, and I know that, you know, it is a it, it is a popularity contest, but ultimately now at this point, I think that what people are going to start realizing is you got to eliminate the strong people and right. not the weak. Right. And your perspective, I think it'd be a lot easier for you to be um, in the finals with me, where you would win easily, as opposed to in the finals with, say, Krista, Monica, or Bunky, where you would be right up in the air. Sure. And clearly at this point, my mom borrowed time. Like you said, dead man walking. You know, it's, if it's not this week, it's next week, you know. What's up? I have pissed the whole house off. I know. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm I at did, the top of the hit list. I did a whole assessment last night, and it's like, okay, will, 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 exactly. will, will. But now, mano a mano, me and you, okay? Goes no further, correct? We'll okay. leave this area. If I don't nominate you, will you give me amnesty when you become the head of household? Certainly. Will you? Okay. I promise you that. I made a deal with the devil, i.e. Kent. Well, the beauty of having me in this house is that I'm the biggest liar in the house maybe the biggest liar in California, and let's go on a limb here, possibly the biggest liar in America. I'm gonna nominate Kent and Hardy next week as soon as I get by this week. Good work tonight, William. What do you Entertaining Hardy. I have a really good time with you and Hardy, you know? I mean, I, the last three people are gonna be here the whole time. The chance of me winning the show is zero, so I certainly would like to be here the last three weeks. The chance of me winning HOH, right next to zero. <laughs> Who are we kidding? I'm the weakest player in the house. Satanic ass of the planet who lost every competition on purpose and thinks it's funny. Because <laughs> we're all stupid to him. The only reason I'm here is because I've incorporated this theory since day one, which is lose everything. I promise. I think Nicole's living in denial. You know, I really try to teach everyone the deep, dark, dankest dungeon that I call my own heart. You don't shake your head. That's what I'm just trying to explain. And uh, they just won't pay attention. I tell them right to their face, I'm going to stab you in the back. I'm going to lie to you. That's what I've been doing. I'm going to continue to do it. I feel as though I need to be the forefront of people's thoughts at the whole, all the time. And for me, it's easier to be at the forefront of their thoughts as a bad person than as a good person. That doesn't make sense, though. None. Zero. Especially being a smart person. If you're dumb, I'd understand it. And they looked me right in the face and they said, no, you won't. We trust you. You're a good guy. And uh, I burn them every time.